Case of a vicious gang initiation killing of a 16 year old girl moves forward. Arnisha Bowers was found murdered. Her body set on fire inside a Northeast Baltimore home. One of her alleged killers is just 14 years old. WJZ is live outside the Mitchell Courthouse downtown where the judge in the case began to hear motions today. Megan McCorkle was inside and explains what's next. Megan. Well, Vic, it is a murder that Baltimore police call absolutely evil. Now the justice process begins for three accused killers. 16-year-old Arnisha Bowers was found inside her grandmother's basement. She'd been raped and strangled. Her body set on fire to cover up the crime. I can only imagine what the last moments of Arnisha life was like. It had to have been pure hell. Three alleged members of the Bloods gang, Adonai Dixon, John Childs, and Rayshawn Rivers are now behind bars. Rivers, just 14 years old, is charged as an adult. Investigators believe the murder was part of a gang initiation. This was supposed to be done in order for one of these guys to get in and another guy to move higher up within this gang. WJZ was there as both John Childs and Adonai Dixon, both in prison jumpsuits, were led into the courthouse today. Dixon family members saying they want the truth to come out. Today, the judge granted a motion to separate the trials of some of the defendants. Childs and Rivers are still set to be tried together. Dixon will have his own trial. Bauer's family has been waiting more than a year for justice in her death. Arnisha had a beautiful smile, and everyone would comment when they met her, you have a lovely smile. She had a beautiful heart to match. Now her alleged killers face life behind bars. And trial dates for the three are expected to be set on Monday. Live outside the courthouse, Megan McCorkle, WJZ Eyewitness News. Megan, thank you. A judge previously denied request to move 14-year-old Rivers' case to juvenile court, saying this was a calculated crime.